Hello and welcome to the Selective Sound tutorial on how to get in and plan your wedding reception through the online planning portal. We hit the client login button from our first page. In this case we're using a testing account. You log in. You will be able to see how many days are left to your wedding, the minutes, seconds, previous emails that we've sent to you, upcoming meetings, and then you will see the tabs at the top showing my events, my profile, which will be your username and password. You can always change your password. All of your info. If you need to edit your info for any reason, please do so. And as soon as you hit the button, it will receive us. If you need to contact us, it shows you the contact information as well as how to get there. And if you go to the home, plan my event. This is the fun part. You could print all of your planning forms right there. You can add requests just by hitting the add request button. You have eight must plays, 25 play if possible, three dedications, five play only if requested, and eight do not plays. Special songs. You will see here introduction of bride and groom, wedding party dance, father daughter dance, uh, different versions. You can print your requests. The wedding planning form is very important. This is a form you will edit and go through. It'll ask you and help you guide you through your entire reception from beginning to end. This is information that we ask you to fill out to the best of your ability. We also have the wedding names form. This is extremely important because we want to know how all the names are in relationships and who's in your wedding. So when we meet with you, we can actually go over those names specifically. When all of this information is entered, you need to hit save. Very, very important to hit save. If you're doing a monogram or a video, they also have planners as well. But again, this is going to make your reception go very smooth, especially with your meeting with your MC or your DJ.